Oh yeah. Woo! It's my happy dance. You know why? Cuz I got a little surprise today. Crispy cream. Yeah. Wow. Yo, yo, yo. Six foot four Honda here once again. Gonna go for a little ride. Gonna let my bitch warm up for like a couple of minutes. When I first started searching for a bike, the number one problem and the number one topic that I searched for days is a sports bike suitable for a tall rider. Or can a tall rider, you know, hop onto a, like a, a CBR or a Ninja or an R6 or whatever and feel comfortable on it? You ready? Here's the answer. Go to a dealership and go sit on one. People could tell you they feel comfortable on a bike no matter what their height is, how small, how big, how fat, how skinny, and how ugly they are. But you will never know how comfortable it is until you sit on it. I mean, I've searched, I've researched, and I've seen people saying they weighed 250 pounds and they were 6'4 on a Honda CBR, a 250, and said they were fine. And then I've seen people saying they're like six foot nothing, and they're like, oh, my knees kill. I feel so cramped up. I can't, I can't ride a CBR. So first I went to a Kawasaki dealership. I was like, yo, I'm not gonna buy a 250, where are they? He's like, oh, they're in the back. So I go in the back, he takes me to like a little garage thing where they stored uh, 250s and he, apparently they only had two for sale. He's like, all oh, the other ones got sold out, so you better buy it quick, you better buy it today. I was like, okay, buddy. He picked it up, he held it straight so I could sit on it without the kicks to really on the ground. Put my hands on the handlebars, feet on the pegs, and uh, you know I was wiggling around, see if I could get comfortable. And honestly, I am six foot four, 185.6 pounds, and it was not comfortable for me. Maybe someone with the same height and weight does feel comfortable, but for my, for myself, it was not comfortable. So uh, I'm like, all right, thanks, man. I'll think about it and I'll see what I'll, I'll give you a call. And I took his card and I threw it away. Um, then I went to a Honda dealership and I sat on their CBR 250 and the guy working there was like, Hey buddy, what's your height? I was like six, four. This is a moto vlog, not a wait in the garage vlog. Hold on. And he's like, Oh wow. You're just in luck. The tallest rider that I've sold a bike to on a 250 was six foot four. So you're just in there, buddy. Sign these papers and just ride the bike up out of here. And I was like. All right, all right, man, I need to think about it. Or I can't just come in and buy a bike. I just came here to look at them. He's like, all right, fine. He gave me his card and, you know, trash. Because I knew I wanted to buy a used bike. After that, you know, in my head, I'm like, I only sat on a 250 Ninja and a 250 CBR. But that those were the two options that I actually wanted preferably. I mean, there were others. I looked at Supermotos. I just didn't like the look. I like the look of... Wow, second gear. Um, I like the look of sports bikes and I like the look of the Ninja and the CBR. So between the two, I wanted a Ninja. I did not feel comfortable. I went with the CBR. And uh, yeah, I mean, I feel com completely comfortable. I don't feel cramped. My ass hurts, but that's because I ride a lot and like snatch, you know, it's, it's it happens unless you get like one of those nice seats. Being six foot four and uh, 186 pounds, I'm dealing all right, man. I feel good. I feel confident on this bike. Being six foot four does not suck. You don't have to go and get like a dirt bike or a supermoto. Um, it's all right, actually, guys. So if you're tall, you got any questions, go ahead and shoot me some questions. I know that uh, my avatar or my display picture on my YouTube account, it's of me on my 250. And I do look tall but i mean i don't i don't think i look too awkward on it there's always going to be that one guy that says oh 250 man that's weak shit you're six foot four man you need more power 250 is not good enough you're too tall for a 250 go and get like a nasty ass strong ass bike bullshit man 250 is all right so yeah if you're a tall rider and you don't know what to do my best advice is go sit on a bike and check it that way because nobody can tell you if you can feel comfortable or not on a bike it's all about how you feel on the bike. I know at the MSF course, I wanted a CBR 250 or a Ninja 250. So I saw 
a Ninja 125, or I think it was a CBR 125. And I tried doing the uh, MSF course class with that. Not a good idea, man. My knees, the, the handlebars were hitting my knees every time I did like a small turn. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Every time I did a small turn. And uh, yeah, so I went with the, I think it was a Yamaha KT or T Yamaha TW, I think it was. It was a 200cc bike. It was a lot more comfortable because, you know, the seating position is more like a chair. And you're just like this. No, 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 no. Like it was a pretty comfortable bike, man. I'm not going to lie. This is the Honda dealership that I was at looking at bikes or testing out the comfortableness of bikes if that's a word no it's not I mean that's that's my opinion that's my advice go sit on a bike don't let other people tell you what's comfortable and what's not and one more thing if you're new to riding you've never been on a bike before and you want to get your first bike do not buy it brand new my opinion IMO in my opinion do not buy a brand new bike you're just wasting money uh, you're bound to drop it thankfully knock on wood I did not drop my bike but if you're a new rider you are bound to drop it statistics say you will drop it and uh, guess what the price on the bike is gonna fly down and uh, I have yet to buy frame sliders but I really want to buy it just in case and that's my opinion on, on tall riders looking for bikes not much of an opinion not much information just because I was only looking at ninjas and CBRs but uh it's something right it's better than nothing so if you guys are looking for a ninja or a CBR a 250 or even a 600 I guess the size is kind of similar just go sit on one that's what I could tell you I just go sit on one and that's it